Hey everybody, this is Tori, and I'm making this video just basically I want to, there's a lot of new people subscribing to my channel, and I just wanted to give everybody a basic introduction about what I do and what is going on on my channel. Um, so let's start all the way in the beginning. This is, uh, this is a long time guild. This guild has been formed in 2003 was originally formed in Star Wars Galaxies and this is a guild that is not your, just your average guild that you see on a server. This guild has been together since 2003. We started on Star Wars Galaxies from Star Wars Galaxies. We moved on to City of Heroes, City of Villains. We have moved on to WoW and we've been in WoW for a very 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 long time and um, we're in Lord of the Rings we are in Dungeons and Dragons. We have Minecraft. We have um, Starcraft. We have a lot. Of, we have a few in the in those free-to-play ones. I, I just can't remember the name right now. But we have chapters everywhere, and it's not your average guild because this is a guild where you know people make friends for life I've known people for many years that I consider family and even this person that just starts in the guild if you have a positive attitude and you get along with people you're considered family in my book no matter how how new you are or how old you are you're all family to me and I treat everybody the same so you know this is that type of guild now um the reason, the reason why you know I'm making this intro video is I have a lot of new people, and it's because of this together the top movement. Now I saw the video when Athene put it out, and it really moved me. As you can see in my the video I did the live video, um, it really moved me because I personally got my shot a long time ago, about three or four years ago, when Hobbs did his live event. I actually filmed it and then uploaded it and gave it to Hobbs and he featured it so if it wasn't for Hobbs I wouldn't have my what 2.3 K subscribers right now um, I would not be anywhere near that so that together to the top really started a long time ago but now it's really getting mainstream and I'm really happy so in the past I've actually highlighted a whole bunch of people but now people a lot of the bigger name people are actually helping out and I really see a large amount of uh, the smaller guys getting a lot of views. And there's so much talent out there that I cannot believe how talented, oh, far more talented than I am. I mean, there's, honestly, <laughs> I want to get a nice intro video that says Order the Black Lotus, but I don't know how to do that stuff. So I really want to get something, and then and there's people out there that know how to do that stuff, and I'm and I see their intro with the with the names and their swirls, and it's just amazing, and I want to do that stuff. So I'm you know I'm gonna learn, and you know that stuff's gonna happen. But there's people out there that are just amazing, far better than I am. Um, so you know, together to the top, we're gonna help each other. You know not just keep you know the small guys down look out for each other I've helped you I'm gonna also highlight a few people and uh, at the end I'm gonna try to highlight two people and I'm gonna put out video videos every week I'm gonna try my best every week uh, try to highlight one or two people every week that way um, we can keep the ball rolling and you know keep people interested now not every video producer is for you but you know, if I highlight somebody, at least check them out. You know, if they if they are your style, subscribe to them. If they're not, no hard feelings. It's not your you know your style of viewing, and they don't interest you. This it's no you know not everyone's the same. But at least you know check them out. See you know spend a minute check out the video and see if you like it. Um. So going back to now my my guys right here. All right, I will start from the top. I have Tore, which is my tank. He is my main. Um, he is the guy that, you know, is the GM of the guild. He puts everything together. He's also a raid leader. I am in charge of raid. We have three raid groups, or actually we four raid groups. Uh, we have raid group one, 
we have raid group two um, we have a third late night group and then we have a midnight graveyard shift group that goes from like 12 server to 3 or 4 in the morning and I, I, I can't personally do that <laughs> there's no way I'm east coast server that just like, it's like 1 to 4 a.m. to me so um, so this Torre he's I would consider very geared I think I'm rank 3 on server for prot pallies on horde side and I believe 5th overall on both sides so I mean my server is not a great server it's not you know the great server like other servers but uh, I'm kinda proud to be third so <laughs> um, my next tune is my druid next geared tune is my druid he is a boomkin druid um, he has a feral off spec uh, his feral is not that great um, but his boomkin, I just love the high crits. I've actually crit over 102k one time, and I basically almost creamed myself. It was just amazing to see such a high crit like that. I was like, oh, I can't believe it. And I want—it's like an addiction. You want to to do it, and you want to get a higher crit than that. You want to get a higher crit. It's just amazing how boomkins are. And when you lay down the mushrooms and you do it uh, on a big crowd. I mean, my DPS can shoot up like to about 150k in one second. It's just amazing how boomkins are. Um, so that's my boomkin. Uh, my next tune that I actually play is my warrior. He is a fury warrior with an arms PVP spec. Of course, I made a warrior because of, of like many of you guys, Swifty. I saw the way he played a warrior in PvP, and I said, I want to play like that too. So I made a warrior, I leveled him up. Uh, he is uh, Titan's Grip Fury for PvP, PvE, and he's Arms for PvP. Really have not brought him into, the, into PvP that much. I kind of lost a little interest in my warrior, uh, so may, maybe I'll get back into him. Uh, he does very good, decent uh, damage. He does about 18k in um, in um, instances. So, you know, that's with him. Uh, next, I have my uh, my mage, which he's just sitting there. I really haven't touched him since 4.1 4. was the last time I touched him. And giggity. Um, so, I really was PvPing with him a lot, but once again, that's a tune that I did actually lose interest in, and I really didn't play with him. Uh, next tune is... Oh, my rogue. Him I'm really getting into. Oh my goodness. He's Assassination, and I'm really enjoying Assassination. I just got the two crafted uh, daggers made for him, and he has pretty good, decent... Uh, gear he's pushing about 18 19 K and he still needs he has a blue helmet and a blue neck and he's pushing that much DPS it is insane the DPS a rogue can push out that's why I love him him I'm very interested in going into PvP I might be doing rogue PvP videos again remember in the past I used to do them a lot well I might start again um, really enjoying and then I have some low level tunes that I, I really want to play a warlock because I have a uh, lock in our guild. His name is Rigo. He is a demonology warlock. And uh, in a troll dungeon, he was pushing 34k. And my mouth dropped. When did demonology get so buffed? Demonology used to be the joke of the of the warlock specs. I know, I know, I know. Affliction is the top DPS don't have to say it I know that but demonology wow they just amazing the DPS so I have a little warlock I have I want to make a priest because priests I think num are number one on DPS overall right now so I really want to work on that um, so um, I'm asking what you guys want to see. Um, 
like right now here's a farm video I'm just farming right here um, if most of you don't know I am a mount tour I do collect mounts I have over a hundred and thirty mounts I think I have like 131 around there and it keeps growing so uh, right now you I'm still farming the Raven Lord mount I'm still fi uh, farming this proto Drake that drops here um, I do the eye um, for the Phoenix mount with the guilt I still do Ani um, to get that mount so um, there's a you know there's a lot that I do on Tori I'm not too much uh, achievement person with my other tunes but Tori is I, I'm an achievement whore yeah that's basically what it comes down to I love achievements on him and I you know I like you know to try to get as much as I can so Tori is covered um, with a lot also let me know if you want to see PvP videos let me know what tune you want me to see PvP you want to see PvP if you want me to start doing PvP on my rogue I will start you know doing rogue PvP videos like I said before I'm gonna try to put out a video once a week so even if it's a battleground um, it's a battleground you know and guys I'm not I do not have an ego and I will never have an ego so if I'm asking for your help I'm not you know I'm not afraid to ask for help so you know uh, if you got any macros or tips or tricks uh, let me know I just slight like I slightly started PvPing again on Torre just to get the feel because I really haven't PvPed since the last arena season so I'm not really uh, that iffy also if you look right here brand new UI that I have it is beautiful but I so much for me to get used to also if you want a UI video let me know I will put out a UI video I have a lot of um, add-ons and some of them are amazing like I'm gonna give you this little hint there's an add-on called reforginator it does all the reforging for you so you never have to like worry about should I reforge to this? Should I? Ref it tells you what you need to reforge, and it's so accurate down to the last last number that it'll tell you to reforge out of this, so you can get hit rating to the exact point. Um, so that's an awesome add-on, and this add-on is just amazing. I love it. Uh, just like once again. I'm very sloppy with the controls right now because I'm still not used to I'm so used to my old UI compared to this one it's much cleaner and neater looking than the last one it was all cluttered and um, I'm also bring, telling you look I actually got the eye off of Ragnaros so I'm gonna make the hammer that's gonna be a legendary that's in my pocket so I'm so happy for that so um, I'm just gonna wrap up this video guys once again just let me know what you want to watch uh, and I will make the videos and I'm gonna leave you with the, um, the two people that I'm gonna give you uh, oh, those are my tunes right there I'm gonna leave a link uh, the two people that I'm gonna recommend for this week and I'm if you want to be recommended leave me a message and I will um, put you in the next video and you know it's like I said to, to everyone it's together to the top we look out for each other and just keep pushing people uh, if you're afraid to do videos give it a shot it's a lot of fun uh, so you know those are my tunes right there I'm gonna show you them real quick you can see some of them are geared and some of them are not geared and uh, well he's right there Dobby he's my warlock I send his uh, his BOEs to someone else but I can gear him up if you want to see a leveling video that's my banker you ain't gonna see videos on him <laughs> and there's a Shami so let me know what you want to watch and I'm gonna leave you with the uh, with the links late everybody peace out thanks for watching together at the top everybody